The two NASA astronauts stuck at the International Space Station still don't know when they'll return to Earth. They've been up there since June, but leaks on their Boeing spacecraft turned their eight-day mission into a much longer stay. We are humans, and this is hard on crew members and their families, and we take that into account. But again, as professional astronauts, they're prepared for this, and they're doing great. Our technical experts are all busy um, diving uh, deeply into all the data that's been generated over the past few weeks, planning for our return options, and, uh, and preparing for uh, some decision points that are ahead. 90, NASA says they still have no idea when the Boeing Starliner crew is coming home. Now, the agency says it'll be another week or so until they even decide how and when to bring their astronauts home. Caroline Elliott is joining us live from Florida's Space Coast, where the crew launched from in early June. Caroline? Matthew Hanna, these two astronauts have now been stuck in space for 71 days. And remember, this was supposed to be a 10-day mission, and now NASA says it could be well into 2025 before they can come back home. Now, NASA didn't give any major updates during that briefing today, but did tell us the team will decide on the astronauts' return by the end of August. NASA says both astronauts on board Butch Wilmore and SUNY Williams are doing well for the most part and making the most of their their extra time in space. The major question now, though, is if the two astronauts will come back on the same spacecraft. NASA says the Boeing Starliner experienced helium leaks and the crew found out about these issues after docking the International Space Station. Even though there's a lot of questions right now, NASA says the number one priority of this mission is safety. Right now, the agency is taking the time to ensure we are not putting the crew at a higher risk than is necessary. And as astronauts, that's always something worth waiting for. Butch and Sonny are very familiar with life aboard the space station. This is their third station mission for both of them. Officials have said if the crew doesn't come back on the same spacecraft, they could be in orbit for the next eight months. Matthew, Hannah.